Anna, don't. You're overreacting. Just calm down. We need the frame intact. Go ahead, shoot me. Destroy your life's work. I've always had humanity's best interests at heart. You never wanted to help us. You used me. In the service of the greater good, yes. What has the Traveler ever really done? It abandoned the elixir, failed to prevent our own collapse, and now it's blessed the Hive with the light. Absurd. I leveraged its power during the Golden Age. I delivered us into a brighter future. And I will protect us from the enemies of humanity. But you risk everything. Risk our survival. Just because you can't control your emotions. Humanity needs me. You need me. We'll fight our enemies together. No. No. What? Do it. Fighting the enemies of humanity. Anna, stop! Stop! What is it that you something? Anastasia, don't! Don't you dare! Upload complete. Secondary personality matrix deleted. I need a minute. You should call Anna on the hollow. She shouldn't be alone right now. You and I can speak afterward. I did it. I... I deleted him. I can't even imagine the damage Clovis would have caused using Rasputin to integrate himself with the Seraph station. Maybe I should have stuck to my guns when Osiris first suggested working with him, but... Here we are. Here's Red. Rasputin. With a voice he's never had before. Thanks to the heuristic systems he adopted from Clovis's Exomind code. All I ever wanted for him, to be able to communicate be able to share his thoughts, his ideas, and I think, I think that desire blinded me to the risks I was taking. It won't happen again. Be careful, the next time you set foot on Europa. Before I deleted him, Clovis broadcasted a warning to himself. I've only been able to decrypt part of it. They know.